Kirsty Allsop recently hit out at Prince Harry following the royal's discussion of his drug use. The location, location, location presenter, 51, has doubled down on her comments as the property expert said she fully supports King Charles, the Queen Consort and the Prince and Princess of Wales. The Channel 4 favourite admitted she had been a fan of Harry and Meghan Markle until recently. The property expert reacted to another social media user, Kathy, who claimed she was being unbiased and added that the presenter's late mother, Lady Fiona Hindlip, was pals with Camilla. Kathy went on, anyway who hasn't had a puff? I know folks who use it for pain and anxiety. It helps. It's even legal in certain countries. Kirsty hit back, it's Kirsty with a E. My mother has been dead for nine years. I am an independent person with my own views. I have always been vocal about those who are casual about the use of cocaine. The person in question then asked, my apologies, sorry about your mom, but are you unbiased about Harry? The Channel 4 presenter went on to dismiss the allegation before explaining why she no longer supports Harry. The small screen star made reference to his Netflix docuseries and his explosive memoir Spare. Kirsty responded, No, I am not unbiased about Harry I am a fan of his dad, brother, sister-in-law and, yes, his stepmom. I was also a big fan of his and Meghan's until relatively recently. Having seen all the Netflix shows and listened to him read his entire book I am less of a fan. It comes after the Duke of Sussex explained what various stimulants and psychedelics did for him during a live-streamed Q&A with drama expert Dr. Gabor Mate. During the conversation, he claimed that marijuana really helped him mentally but taking cocaine did nothing for him. Taking to Twitter on March 5th. Kirsty told her 434,600 followers, someone needs to tell Prince Harry that county lines doesn't mean doing coke in the home counties. It means that stuff you took to ease your trauma, was soaked in the blood of those whose own trauma and lives are as far from your privileged bubble as it is possible to get. Twitter user, Lady Applejack Vibes stepped in to defend the royal. They penned, why can't we just get to the point where we have open and honest conversations about how Britain snorts more coke than almost everywhere else in Europe. More conversations about the prevalence, the cost socially and economically as well as the abuse entailed in importing it. Taking to the micro-blogging site, Kirsty replied, I'm all for that, sadly that is not what Prince Harry was doing. Prince Harry opened up about his drug use in a live question and answer session set up to promote his explosive new memoir, Spare. Speaking about cocaine, he told Dr. Mate, that didn't do anything for me. It was more of a social thing. He added, it gave me a sense of belonging for sure. It also made me feel different to the way I was feeling, which is kind of the point. Express.co.uk previously contacted Prince Harry's representatives for comment.